Showtime takes a luscious look at the ladies who launched a million fantasies. Richard Dawson hosts the Playboy Playmate reunion. Hugh Hefner has gathered 25 years of Playboy magazine centerfolds together for one fantastic party at his palatial California mansion. We can't show you the whole story here, but you won't want to miss a minute of the Playboy Playmate reunion right here on Showtime. If there's a vote, the eyes have it. The eyes of Miss Pat Collins, the hip hypnotist. You'll be amazed and amused at what these six people do when she's in control. They're magazine centerfolds, and they'll let their hair down. Take their clothes off and respond to her suggestive suggestions. Hey, I can be a centerfold, too. Tim, open your eyes, I'm naked. See Pat Collins, the hip hypnotist, and six centerfolds, a hot ticket on Showtime. Just relax. Sit down. Relax. You will do exactly as my voice tells you. Hit the like button. Subscribe. And ring the bell. This is Ava Bonet. She's part German and part French. But in December 1981, she was all centerfold as the penthouse pet of the month. This is Ron Olin. He works in the film department at a Hollywood motion picture studio. In 1981, he was Playgirl's Man for November. This is Carmen Pope. She's a receptionist at a Beverly Hills beauty salon. But in March 1978, she was the centerfold pet of the month in Penthouse Magazine. This is Tim Wenzel. He's a student at the University of Southern California. In 1981, he was Playgirl centerfold man for October. One of these people is Barbara Schaefer. She's a housewife married to a plumber. You may have seen her as a blonde on the pages of Penthouse, and soon she will become a centerfold. This is Bill McAnally, who you can usually see on the beaches of San Diego. And in 1980, you guessed it, he was Playgirl centerfold man for June. Tonight, you'll see these six beautiful centerfolds as nobody has ever seen them before because they've come to the Laugh Stop in Los Angeles to participate in the most unique nightclub performance in America. Ladies and gentlemen, the one, the only, Hollywood's hip hypnotist, Miss Pat Collins. Thank you very much. I love you too. Welcome. Good evening to our pajama party for this evening. <laughs> and for those of you who not had a chance to see my show before, I'm going to give you a very fast and a very brief explanation of what is about to happen. In a few moments, we're going to be inviting about five or six of you to come up on the stage and to volunteer to be hypnotized. Now, this is for real, and if you'd like to come up, you're more than welcome. But before we have you venture up here, I want to explain to you exactly how you're going to feel. See, most people do not understand the signs of hypnosis, and they seem to think if they come up here and go under, as we call it, that they're going to be unconscious and not know what they're doing. Believe me, gang, that's wrong. And most stage hypnotists don't explain it, which is equally wrong. The biggest bonus is that you're going to be up here for about... 45 minutes to an hour. One hour of hypnosis means you go back to your seat with the equivalent of eight to ten hours sleep. So for those of you that want to swing all night, enjoy yourself. <laughs> um, all right, if you're nice enough to be in the show, if I can help you in any way when the show's over, I'd be more than happy to do so, as always. But in this, on the stage, we're going to do it, like I say, in good taste, have a lot of fun, um, be creative, and look for hidden talent. Just be very, very sincere, all right? And those of you who want to give it a try, you're more than welcome. There are stairs on both sides. Come on up, get in bed, we'll start the show. We've got some beautiful people for you tonight. Beautiful, beautiful people, come on up. To go to the dream, all right? You are too, ah, it's wonderful. Um, to be what it seems. All right, we have, a, we have a whole group of wonderful, gorgeous people here tonight. Um, 
all either present or ex-centerfold. So if you didn't, I'll tell you, if you didn't make it up your fast enough, I'll explain how you can go on in the audience. And even you, the audience, you can try to. And if I lose anybody, you know, on stage, if you want to come up, you're more than welcome. What's your first name, sir? Frank. Good. Did you look on the back of your charts and check that out? <laughs> all right. Say Frank. Frank, the boy down front. Say Frank were to go on in the audience and I'd say, would you like to come up, Frank? And he'd go, no, ma'am. If I were to sales talk him into getting up here, you know what he'd do? He'd sit up here and sleep to the whole show, so that's no fun. Hmm. I don't mean it's no fun to sleep with you, Frank. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, you wouldn't do anything in the show, Frank. <laughs> all right, if you can try the audience, settle back, stare at one object, do everything my voice tells you, all right? In the meantime, we're just going to kind of look dim a little bit, and we're going to ask all of you to be very, very quiet. And those of you stage, want you to settle back in your seat, get your feet flat on the floor, hands your lap, keep your hands open. Due to television regulations, the sound portion of Pat Collins' hypnotic induction of these six people will not be heard so as to ensure that none of you in the viewing audience will in any way have the possibility of being hypnotized by Miss Collins, who has performed for over 20 years here in Los Angeles, in Las Vegas, and around the country. This is definitely one of the hottest tickets in town, as she has consistently played to sold-out audiences. And during those years, over 20,000 people have come up on her stage to be hypnotized. And in all those times, every single performance has been different, because no two people react the same while under hypnosis. At times, it may be hard to believe that the people on the stage are really under. But in the course of each performance, Pat does something that proves conclusively that they are. No one has ever left her show not believing that the people on the stage were really hypnotized. And now back to Miss Collins. Okay, all of you in the audience that are hypnotized, when I count to three, I want you to wake up and enjoy the show. That's just for the audience, okay? All of you in the audience, when I count to three, wake up and enjoy the show. Those of you on the stage, when I count to three, relax your left arm and go deeper. Sleep, one, two, and three. Sleep way down, deep sleep. Relax every muscle in your body, continue to breathe very deeply. Let me explain what I do. I'm going to do my regular show. I spend the first five minutes of all of my shows doing exactly the same thing, but it's always different because the people are different. Now, even though we have a special theme going tonight, uh, I don't know the people, right? I'm going to start out by giving what I call reflex suggestions. Reflex suggestions mean I'm going to suggest they're going to react with reflexes. Example, when I say all of you laugh at a funny movie, visually they don't really see the funny movie, all right? But they laugh out loud because of suggestions in their head. Analyze them with me, okay? So we get to get to know them. Thank you for being quiet. Enjoy yourself. Here we go. Another night, another forehead. All right. All these stages, take a very deep breath. Now relax your body and go deeper sleep. Those of you on the stage, you're the people who are going to use in the show throughout the rest of the show. Sound of my voice, touch of my hand. Music sends you deeper sleep. Ah, all inhibitions are gone. You're not embarrassed. You have a marvelous time with suggestions. When I count to three, I'm going to take off the stage to a very funny movie, and you will laugh out loud. On the count of three, all of you just laugh out loud because you think you see the movie, but do not awaken. One, two, and three. There's a very funny movie in your imagination. All of you stay. Sit up in chair and laugh out loud. Laugh out loud. Laugh louder and louder. Louder and louder. Very funny movie. Getting funnier and funnier. Funnier and funnier. Very funny movie. Funny, funny movie. Funnier. Funnier and funnier. I mean, it's a funny thing. Laugh out. When I count to three, stop laughing. One, two, three. Sleep. Wait on deep sleep. No movie. <laughs> Obviously, <laughs> oh, he's going right down to the Twin City Federal there. Okay, obviously up your chair. This room is getting very cold. You're beginning to shiver and shake. All of you begin to shiver and shake. Your, your hands are getting cold. Rub your hands together. All of you, rub your hands together. Rub them faster, faster, faster. Cold hands, cold hands, cold hands. Terrible draft on the back of your neck. Terrible draft on the back of your neck. Rub your neck, rub your neck to warm it up. Now your legs are getting cold. Rub your legs. All of you, rub your legs, rub your legs to warm them up. Cold legs, cold legs. Now you're not cold. You're getting hot, hot and sticky. Fan yourself. All of you, fan yourself. Hot room. Hot room, you're getting hotter and hotter and hotter and hotter and hotter and hotter and hotter. Your feet are beginning to burn an itch. Blow on your feet. All of you, blow on your feet. Blow on your feet to cool them off. Hot shoes. Hot shoes. Hot shoes. Blow on your feet. Cool them off. And freeze in that position. Don't move a muscle. You're not hot. You're not cold. You're just relax. All right. Okay, what's her name? Barbara. Barbara. Oh, Barbara. Barbara, you're sitting in a hot chair. Hot chair, Barbara. Hot chair. Hot chair. Hi. Oh, oh. <laughs> Hi there. It's not really hot. All right. Think you're hypnotized, Barbara? No. You don't. Well, you are, believe me. Uh, what month are you? I know you're centerfold. These are all centerfolds. I'll be coming out. You're coming out? Oh, God. I <laughs> she means she's coming out in the magazine, right? Yeah. Wh which, which, which magazine? So we can all go home and say, oh, I saw her. Ten House. Ten House. Which month? I'm not sure yet. <laughs> Sit down. You're naked. Okay, I'll let them be naked. <laughs> oh, that's interesting. Ah. Oh, that's interesting. Ha <laughs> ha
Sleep. You're not naked. Oh, that's interesting. Uh -huh. All right. Let me explain something. Again. When I say, where's the person that's with Barbara? All right. When I say hot chair, it's not really hot. I'm not hurting them. It's a suggestion and then a reflex. It's my way of getting them up. You can't say up dick. <laughs> or up here. I set up Chuck one night that was without a doubt the worst show of my career. It was all up dick. So I'm not really hurting them. Okay. What's his name? Huh? Tim. Tim hot chair. Hot chair Tim. No. Freeze. I uh, see, hot chair means up. Tim goes down. <laughs> as long as you're there, Tim. Uh, <laughs> Tim, stand up. Stand up, Tim. Stand up. Up, Tim. Up, Tim. Hi, Tim. Hi. Think you're hypnotized? No way. All right. Uh, which uh, magazine are you in, and which month are you? Playgirl. I was Mr. October, 1981. Mr. Write that down. I want to check that out. <laughs> Okay, sit down. You're naked, naked, naked. You're a naked person. <laughs> Sleep Tim. That's really interesting, isn't it? <laughs> He's a positive singer, took two hands to cover it up. Use your finger covered up every time. Okay, what's her name? Ava Hot Chair. Hot Chair Ava. Hot Chair, Hot Chair. That's it. Keep him up, honey. Keep him up. Good. Okay, think so you're hypnotized, Ava? No. Oh, you don't really? You are. Which month are you? December 80. Of which magazine? Penthouse. December 80. I hope you're all making notes of this. Okay, sit down. You're naked. Naked, Ava. Somehow I didn't think she was going to care. <laughs> Sleep. That's interesting. Somehow I, for some reason, I thought she was going to go. Mm -hmm. Oh, you want? Hey, I can be a centerfold too. Tim, open your eyes. I'm naked. Hey, 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 hey. I'm a naked lady. <laughs> why is he laughing? He... Sleep, Tim, deeply. They... Why is he laughing? <laughs> I whip mine out. No, they don't see me naked. It's a suggestion. Uh, so why is he laughing? Probably saw my tattoo. Okay, now going right down the line. We have, okay, well, da, 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 da. okay, what's his name? Hello? Who, what am I bid for this man? Billy. Oh, thank you. B Billy? Billy Hot Chair. Hot Chair Billy. Oh, good. Oh, you get it up. Nice. Oh, I can tell you're one of them. <laughs> Hi there. <laughs> His are bigger than mine. <laughs> Relax. Think, you, think you're hypnotized, Billy? No. Uh, you are, you are. What, okay, which magazine and which month? Playgirl, June 80. Playgirl June 80. Okay, you know I'm going to check this all out. You know that. I'm going to get the issues and I'm going to say, hmm, mm, I remember him. <laughs> Sit down, you're naked. You're a naked person. <laughs> Sleep. He got there. He blushed. He blushed. All right. What's her name? Marvin. Huh? Carmen Hot Chair. Hot Chair Carmen. Hi. Oh, she did that very nice. Hi, Carmen. Think you're hypnotized? Um, well, no. Well, yes, no, I know, but you guess because you're not unconscious. Which month are you and who are you and where? Uh, Penthouse Magazine, March 1978. Oh, all right. Now we got to go digging in the basement. <laughs> we'll find the issue, though. Sit down. You're naked, Carmen. Sit down. You're naked. You know what's interesting? I do the naked bit on every single show, and usually they're going, hoo hoo, these are centerfolds, and they're all going, oh my god, I'm not getting paid for this one. <laughs> I'm not getting paid, why should I care? Or they got to get a staple for doo doo. Okay, oh, look at him. <laughs> okay, what's his name? Ron Hot Chair. Hot Chair, no jumping, Ron. No jumping, no jumping, Ron. Look at me, come here. Oh, we got a bun warmer here. Go ahead, warm your buns up. I don't care. All right, now, look at me. No jumping, no falling. Don't go near the edge of stage. Crocodiles are out there. Bite your thing off. Do you think face your face this way? Do you think you're hypnotized? I don't think so. Oh, you're so out of breath. Are we having a nice dry dream? Good. Uh, okay. Which month are you and which magazine? Uh, the Playgirl spread of November 81. It's the spread of 81, Playgirl. Yes. Okay, because all these people are going to probably, you know, you're naked. Sit down. <laughs> He's also going to be in the spread of field and stream, and he's going to be in the spread of good housekeeping. And if we condense it, rub it hard enough and condense it, we'll get him in Reader's Digest. Okay, uh, now.
That's our group game. Now, all I'm going to do is run through names and memorize names again and uh, remember who's got what. Uh, okay. We, we have Barbara, Tim, uh, Ava. Ava with an A. Barbara, Tim, Ava. Was it Bill? Bill or Billy? Billy. What does he like to be called? Bill or Billy? Bill. 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 Uh, Bill. 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 And Carmen and uh, uh, Mr. Stud. Uh, Ron. Okay, now we'll go fast. All of these days, take a very deep breath. Relax your body. Go deeper sleep. You're the people who are going to use the show. Relax. Have fun with the show. Uh, when I count to three, obviously, open your eyes, not awake, and sit up in a chair. Obviously, you're very angry. You're mad at the person sitting next to you because that person has a very bad odor. <laughs> And you will tell them off, but good. But you will not use your hands or bad language, but on the count of three, very bad odor, come the one sitting next to you. One, two, three. All of you, set up a chair. Terrible odor, come the one sitting next to you. Without a doubt, the most horrible thing you've ever smelled before in your life. So it's stronger and stronger. Disgusting to come in like, I mean, really bad. I mean, no, gross, though. Gross. I mean, really bad. It's him. Bad, bad, bad. And, and all of you, sleep way down deep sleep. <laughs> On the count of three, it's a nice order. One, two, three. Do, do, be, do. Do, be, do, be, do, do, be, do, do, be, do. Do, be, do, be, do, do, be, do, do, be, do. Do, be, do. Oi, freeze. <laughs> Have you met Barbie and Ken? And Bob? All right, when I count to three, I'll be sleep. One, two, three, sleep. Wait on, deep sleep. Relax, go deeper. Mm. Mm, sit up and sleep alone. Mm, thank you very much. All right, Tim, hot chair, hot chair, Tim, hot chair. Open your eyes. Come here. Don't come here. Walk here. The rest of you sleep deeply. Relax, down, deep, 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 deeper and deeper. Are you hypnotized yet? No. Okay, I'm gonna, all right, look at me. I'm a star. I'm going to prove it to you. Your thing is gone. Bye-bye, love. Look for it. Bye-bye, happiness. Must have fell off. Hello, loneliness. I didn't have to go on crying. Look for it. Bye, love. I'm there. Hello, loon. What did it look like? I hope you find it. Wait, cut the music, cut the music. Hey, 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 hey. He took your thing. He's got your thing. He gave it back to... Wait, look at me. Tim, Tim. This is not funny. This is not funny. Look at me. The whole career. Uh, look at me. Don't look at your thing. He's got your thing. Now you just tell Frank, you got to have your thing back. And as you speak, your tongue keeps sliding out of your mouth. Talk to him. Tim, look at me. Are you hypnotized? No, I'm not. You should sure? talk to him. <laughs> Wait, freeze. Sleep. Well, girls, the point of that whole thing is that one door closes, another opens. Okay, open your eyes. Open your eyes. It's okay, Tim. I'm just teasing. You got it back. Go sit down. You got two of them. Three of them. <laughs> Yo, how Timmy, you've got six of them. <laughs> Six girls, look, he's got six. He's got over here, Tim. He's got six things. Six of them. Go photograph him. He's going to be a centerfold for six months in a row. Go photograph him. Photograph him. What the hell? Be proud, Tim. You're a centerfold. Freeze. I wonder what she's photographing him with. She didn't even have a camera. Whatever. Okay, when I count to three... <laughs> uh, when I count to three... Uh, <laughs> I think I'll just leave them there. No. When I count to three, all of you girls sit back down in your chairs uh, and uh, polish up your belly buttons on the count of three. One, two, three, back to your seats. <laughs> Tim, look. Look at me, Tim. You've only got one. But it'll work six times. <laughs> Tim, six times in one night. <laughs> okay, I'll be sleep way down deep sleep. <laughs> uh, well, if the guys got some, the girls get some too. Well, I count to three. Well, I count to three. All of you, set me chairs. Girls and guys alike, and watch your boobs grow. Biggest boobs are going to get a prize. One to three. Bigger. 
juggle those knockers. Juggle them. Boobs are stuck on the ceiling. One, two, three. <laughs> Freeze. Mm, go to another one. I count to three. Barbara, sit up your chair and juggle your boobs. One, two, three. Oh, now that's juggling. You've got three of them. <laughs> juggle them, baby. Juggle them. Come on, you can do it. You got six of them. <laughs> faster, 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 faster. Sleep, sleep. She's cute. She's got the cues for it. Go ahead, too. When I count with you, Bill, hope your eyes not awake and stand up. Spotlights and cameras. You're a great actor. You're playing the part of a moon man. You've just landed Earth. You speak only moon talk. And on, <laughs> he's going to be the scientist. On the count with you, Tim, you're a great scientist. You're going to translate what the moon man is telling us. I want some creative dialogue here. One, two, three, up, roll them action dialogue. Moon Man scene, take one. Hi there. Do you speak Moon Talk? Oh, sure, yeah. Oh, you do? Oh, come here, come here, come here. Come here. Ask the Moon Man if he'll take me back. Look. Take me back to the moon with him. Tell him about my big antennas. <laughs> <laughs> you can do it. Come on, sweetheart. You can do it. Come on, we're making a movie here. You know. Right, okay. <laughs> Oh, hmm. Oh. Is this an answer or is he just breathing heavy? Okay, what did he say? He says he's ready to doubt. Wait, wait! Unhand me, oh great moon man! Not yet! Ask him how they do it on the moon with the gravity and all. I don't want to make the trip unless it's different. You know, waka, waka, waka. Okay, um, um. Okay, when I count to three, both of you uh, do the soft shoe back in your seat. One, two, three. Actually, freeze. When I count with you, first of all, you set me chairs and pose because all the photographers are here for the new magazine and you're all centerfolds again on the count of three. One, two, three. Stepped out of a dream. You are too wonderful to be what it seems. Mm, could there be lips like yours? Could there be eyes like yours? <laughs> La -la Wait, freeze. What magazine are we talking about over here? Is this one of those funny little valley magazines that they sell in the valley at the newsstands? Go, here, little girl, take that home and read that. <laughs> oh, I'm going to work with them one at a time. I'll let them act and do things. All right, uh, who's with Barbara? Who's with Barbara? Are uh, you with Barbara? Are you her husband or her boyfriend? You fool around circle one. <laughs> Oh, good. Come here. You're gonna get some la di da di da da la di da Yeah, come up here. I'm gonna run in the big bed. All right? All right, stand right over here so the whole room can see the orgy. So you're not on her. She's on her. What time do you want to get it tonight? Listen, what's your name? All night. All night. All night. If you can't get them when they're awake, that's your problem. No. What's your name? Chris. Chris. Okay, hang in there. That one's yours, right? Yeah. That's your wife, for sure. You're not doing a number on me. I mean, it's for real. Barbara, take a deep breath. When I count with you, Barbara, you'll open your eyes, you'll not awaken. You're a great actress. You're in the movies. You're playing the part of a goddess of love. And when you... <laughs> when you see your husband, Chris, an urge will come over you, and you're going to grab him and give him the most passionate kiss you've ever given him before in your life. Hey! 
so passionate your lips are stuck tight and you can't stop until I tell you. <laughs> Enjoy, sweetheart. On the counts, we open your eyes and go give it to him. One, two, three. Fly me to the moon and let me swing among the stars. Let me see what love is like on Jupiter and Mars. In other words, hold my hand. In other words, oh darling, kiss me. When I count to three, Barbara, when I count to three, not yet, but when I count to three, and I'll show you, no, you will stop kissing that man because in the count of three, you do not know that man. It's a strange man, you're shocked, and you're embarrassed. I'm gonna count to three, one, two. What the hell was it, two and a half? <laughs> three, just friends. Lovers no more Just friends Not like before To think of what they've been And not to kiss again Seems like pretending Barbara, you can see your husband sitting out there explaining to him what you're doing with this man No I don't know, baby. Well, tell him something you just tell me you're making a movie and you're making lots of money and he'll understand that. <laughs> he won't understand that? Well, tell him anyway. See if he will. <laughs> Booby, I'm making a movie. <laughs> Sleep. You're a good sport, Booby. <laughs> Should I tell her to remember you want to swing for a few days? Uh, yeah. Oh, give him a nice big hand. Give him a nice big hand. <laughs> so, you go back and I'll... I'll, I'll Barbara, go sit down in your chair and juggle your boobs again. She likes that. Come on, juggle them, sweetheart. This is a new show. A new career on the horizon. Up, down, up, down. Come on, you got two, you got three, you got six. Come on, you can do it. Sleep, you got two. She's cute. She really is cute. She's a very good spot. Thank you. Tim, open your eyes, step in your chair. Look on your left knee, there's a phone. I want you to dial information and we'll call up George Washington and find out what to do about the red coats. I appreciate your help. Is there... <clears throat> information, may I help you? Yeah, uh, give me the number of uh, George Washington, please. That's listed in your directory, sir. I'm sorry, but I didn't get one this year. You didn't get one what, sir? I didn't get a directory. I didn't get a directory. Would you please... Why didn't you get a directory, sir? Do you have a disease? <laughs> yeah, yeah, I have a fucking disease. <laughs> Would you please just give me the number of George Washington, all right? Well, I'm information. I'm here to help you, sir, but I don't understand why you didn't get your directory. Would you like to report that, sir? No. I mean, as long as I'm on the line, I can take the report. No, I don't want to report it. I just want George Washington right now, please. Or I want to talk to a supervisor right now. Right now. <laughs> Hold on, sir. I will definitely connect you with a supervisor. <laughs> Hello? This is your supervisor, sir. How may I help you? <sighs> Hello? This is your supervisor, sir. Oh, God. I, uh, I, I wanted the phone number for George Washington. Do you think you, uh, I don't want to bother you, but do you think you can give me the phone? Um, do you think you, um, um, how can I help you, sir? God. Uh, oh God, don't rub my back like that. <laughs> oh, Tim, every time you have a dirty thought, slap your face. Mm -hmm. <laughs> 
Every time you have a horny thought slap your face. Put the phone down, ding ding. Good, sleep. <laughs> He's cute. He's cute. He's really is cute. sleep way down deep sleep sit back and sleep all right we're going to get serious for a few minutes and i'm going to do my crusade for hypnotherapy then we'll give them all a screen test which is the best part of the show anyway all of you sit up in your chairs and sleep just relax and sleep see the greek word hypno means sleep and they look like they're sleeping but they're not they know every single thing that's going on it's just they're less critical much less critical and super suggestible but i can't change them and i can't make them do anything they don't want to do whatever they do they'll do better when they're under hypnosis because their inhibitions are gone and more creative but they have not lost control if anything they've gained it now all of you on the stage this is not funny it's serious when i count to three on all of your stage to raise your right arm high in the air light as a feather one two three raise your right arm high in the air now concentrate in your right arm this time when i count with you all of you make your right arm rigid as a piece of steel one two three rigid spread your fingers out make your fingers rigid all right now concentrate this time when i count with you all of your stage your right arm and your right hand will become cold and numb like you've had a shot of novocaine and you have no feeling of pain in your right arm or your right hand on the count of three one two three cold and numb now if you're with these people don't get bugged because i do this every show they feel it but they don't feel pain they feel warmth i could do this all day long and the only thing that happens is the hair would singe off well i'll show you Watch this, turn it this way a little bit. <laughs> it's a weird, rigid. Well, this doesn't hurt, it just usually smells. Mm -hmm. But see, it doesn't hurt. You know what I could do? I wouldn't, but I could. I could take a cold object like a pencil or something and touch him and say, you know, I am burning you. And if they, if they were to buy that suggestion, in about an hour or so, they'd raise a water blister for nothing but a suggestion. A lot of things are hypnosis. Women have babies under hypnosis every day. It's called natural childbirth. <laughs> Doctors didn't want to use the word hypnosis because they thought that would spook somebody, right? Karate, yoga, if you're into any of the martial arts, those are all forms of self-hypnosis. How can a person take a hand or a foot or a knee and break a cement block? You know what they've done? They've concentrated so hard, they get all that energy and wacko. Or so-called miracles, a woman will lift the rear end of an automobile because she saw a child underneath a car. Everybody goes, that's fantastic. That lady lifted a car. What happened was shock and suggestion. She's got to, got to lift the car. She has tons of steel before she stops to think she shouldn't be able to do it. My point is who says you shouldn't be able to do it. All right, let me get their things down, their arms down, and <laughs> I'll show you the kind of control. When I count with you, I'll be lower your right arm. It's completely back to normal. One, two, three. Sleep. Way down. Deep sleep. Relax. Sleep. All right, someone in the audience who's never seen my show before and doesn't know anybody on the stage, raise your hand. I want the audience to pick who I make rigid because if I pick, it's going to look very good. Okay, man, there. pick one of the people you want rigid. Which one? One in yellow. One in the yellow? All right. With her, <laughs> hey, hey, hey. With her permission. Okay. Um, Barbara. Barbara, open your eyes and not awaken. Can I have her permission to stretch you between two chairs if I promise not to hurt you? Sure. Uh, <laughs> sleep. Okay. Is it okay with you? I won't hurt her. Yeah, okay. yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. Barbara, open your eyes. Don't wake up. Come here. Come here. Short kind of control. This is amazing. It feels like a massage. It doesn't hurt at all. So, okay. okay. Now face, don't face the audience. Audience. Put your legs together. Arms your side. Close your eyes. Head back. Now just relax. Every muscle in your body get limp and heavy like a wet rag, but don't fall. You got it. All right, Barbara, in a few moments, you'll be stronger than you've ever been before. No fear, no pain, trust me. When I count with you, Barbara, lock the muscles in your arms. Rigid as a piece of steel. One of the rigid. Spread your fingers out. Lock them tight to the sides of your body. Rigid, 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 rigid. She's got it. On the count of three, lock the muscles in your neck. One, two, three, neck rigid. On the count of three, back and chest rigid. One, two, three. On the count of three, stomach spine rigid. One, two, three. On the count of three, legs rigid. One, two, three. Every muscle in your body locked tight. Keep your hands to your side rigid. You cannot bend your body until I tell you. When I count with you, Barbara, fall backward. As you fall backward, become more rigid. We'll catch you. Arch your back up high in the air. You're as light as a feather. One, two, three, back. Rigid as a piece of steel. Every muscle in your body locked tight. You cannot bend until I tell you. But you feel like you're floating on a cloud. And you're going deeper and deeper sleep. You want to give her a nice big hand, gang? She did it. I didn't. She can hear you. The reason, the reason, can you see that's where yeah. The reason I let the audience pick, if I pick the person to put between two chairs, someone's going to say, you got wires up there. There's no wires. I do this every, or like Muscle Beach guys will go, well, I can do it. I'm strong. If you're strong, you can do it, but not like this. Without hypnosis, you got to huff or puff or get a hernia. She's not straining in any way. What has happened, she's in her subconscious when they're under, and she's controlling her body. And she's controlling her body. <laughs> and I like it when they pick guys and they get rigid everywhere. <laughs> I've had that happen. Then I just turn the cup over and we have brunch later. Okay. <laughs> She can stay up there for hours. Gang, you all have control over your mind, your body, and the things that you want to do with your life. So just stay in touch. All right, let's get her down. When I count to three, Barbara, you may relax. Everything. Uh, on the count of three, one to three, relax. Open your eyes, stand straight. Give her a big hand for volunteering. Come on. Nice, like a massage. Shalom. 
All right, relax, safe, safe. All right, so again, you must remember, they, do, they don't lose control, they gain control, they're not unconscious and everything's going on. You know what we're gonna do now? We're gonna give them a screen test. And I like to do this kind of fast so they don't think they just do, but as you probably know, <laughs> they're pretty loose now. And everybody's a ham, everybody's a basic ham. Every show you see, it's, it's something different. All right, when I count to three, obviously stage, you'll open your eyes, you're not awake, and you stand up, stay in front of your chairs, look into those spotlights, in your mind the spotlights are cameras, put your makeup on, you're gonna be in the movies. I am your director. Be only my voice. Lots of talent scouts are in the audience. On the count of three, I stand up, put your makeup on, you're going to be in the movies. One, two, three. You're going to be in the movies. La dee da da da. Up. You're going to be in the movies. La dee da da dee da da. You're going to be in the movies. La dee da da da. You're going to be in the movies. La dee da da dee da. Freeze. When I count with you, obviously, look in the cameras. Make funny faces. You're great comedians. One, two, three. Doobie doo doo. Doobie doo Our new centerfold for Humpty Dumpty. Will I count it? Oh! Oh, you gotta see this gang. Looks like a guppy in heat. On the count of you have a stage or a washing machine. What is your washing machine? Come on, be creative. You're getting clogged up. Looks like we have a new poster boy. <laughs> when I count to three, I, I tell him to drain, but not with him up here. <laughs> when I count to three, obviously, stage our method actors, you're be creative, you are bacteria. One, two, three, bacteria. <laughs> you are bacteria. <laughs> Infecting evil, ugly bacteria. Freeze. When I count to three, you're penicillin. One, two, three, penicillin. <laughs> <laughs> they can relate to that. Uh, when I count to three, obviously. <laughs> when I count to three, obviously, stage are, are in the movies. You are beautiful, beautiful, graceful hula dancers. So do a beautiful, beautiful, graceful hula dance on the count of three. One, two, three. This group is not going to relate to lack of nookie. <laughs> but, oh, I know what they'll relate to when I count it through every stage. You're a vibrator. One to three, you're a vibrator. <laughs> One with batteries. When I count with you, obviously you sit down and sleep except for Bill. Bill, you're the head, no, the leader. <laughs> Vibrator, one, two, three. <laughs> three. Next time, a little bit lower and to the right. When I count through every stage, you get up once again, you're in the movies, you're still great dancers, you're Tahitian dancers. Uh, do an exotic Tahitian dance, one, two, three. We need a little bit more motivation. When I count through all these stage, you're doing the dance of the Virgin Sacrifice. From memory, I'm sure. <laughs> On the count of three, one, two, three. Faster, 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 faster,
Luana. He's going, hey, Luana. When I count with you, I've your belly dancers. One, two, three. Freeze, what I count with you off his stage are flamenco dancers, one, two, three. Ole, wait, freeze, freeze. I can't say ole with this group. They have me on the floor in three seconds flat. Huh? And besides, it's a verb, yes. What I count with you off his stage are chorus girls. Do your bumps and grinds, but no, no kicking. Just bumps and grinds and I count with you, one, two, three. Wait, freeze. I think we have a star here, gang. <laughs> But I count with you off your stage except for Ava. Sit down in your chairs. The rest of you are in the band and you may play your favorite instruments. Musical instruments. <laughs> Ava on the count with you, the star of the show, Gypsy Leroux. Do, just do your bumps and grinds. The rest of you sit down and play your instruments. One, two, three. Freeze. I always sleep way down deep sleep. Sing, 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 sing. When I count with you, Ava, you're not a great dancer. You're a great singer. You're a great singer. Uh, spotlights are cameras. You're going to sing, you what, you like the blues. You're going to sing the blues about uh, Frank. You sing the blues about Frank uh, because he's stole your elephant. Took your elephant. You sing the blues about it. Sexy. On the count of three, one, two, three, sing. acting doing uh, scenes and being very dramatic and really getting into some real talent here and out and when they do someone a big hand all right um, we'll start well, we'll do, we're, okay we'll start over here she's got to go where you are right okay take a deep breath Barbara when I count with you Barbara you're a great actress this is your big this is a big time uh, don't have to pose or anything actually on the count three you're a great actress you're in the movie Sweet Charity you're a dance hall hostess like Shirley MacLaine actually you're a hookerette so I want you to dance back to your seat in the audience as you dance back, look for big spenders. They're out there. On the count of three, one, two, three. Boom, ba, ba, do, ba, do. The moment you walked in the joint, I could see you were a man of distinction, a real big spender. Good looking, so refined. Wouldn't you like to know what's going on in my mind? So let me get right to the point. I don't pop my cork for every guy I see. Hey, big spender, bop, 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 bop. Hey, big spender, bop, 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 bop. Spend a little time with me. Do we do we do sleep? Very good, very good. All right. Where, where's Ava going? Where does she go? Over there? She goes with you. Hmm? 
Okay, Ava's going that way. Ava, well now, watch this. We're on top. When I count with you, Ava, you're going to dance back to your seat in the audience. You're also in the movie Big Spender, but you're going to do the finale because you've already found the Big Spenders. But uh, it's Sweet Charity finale on the count of three. One, two, three. If they could see me now, that little gang of mine. I'm eating fancy chow and drinking fancy wine. I'd like to stumble bums to see for a fact the kind of top drawer first rate. Chums I attract, all I can say is wow, we look at where I am. Tonight I'd sleep way down, deep sleep. Sleep. Sleep, baby. Deep sleep. I'll wake her up later. Okay, where's Carmen go? Carmen goes where? Over there, right? Okay, Carmen, when I count her through your great actress, very dramatic now. Uh, back to your seat in the audience. It's raining on your hairdo. One, two, three. Raindrops keep falling on my head. Just like the guy's feet are too big for this bed. Nothing seems to fit. Those raindrops keep falling on my head. They keep falling. Now I just did me some talking to the sun. Sleep, Carmen. Way down deep sleep. All right, Carmen. Relax. I'll wake, I'll wake them all up after the show. Don't worry about a thing. And here we have before, after, and during. <laughs> Okay. Guess who I'm going to save for the finale? <laughs> Sleep deeply, Tim. All right. Uh, where is Ron going? Ron is going where? Right there? There. All right. Where does Ron go? Ron goes to the girl in the green. Okay, right over there. Right? Ron, take a deep breath, honey. When I count you, Ron, you'll open your eyes, not awake, and stand up. You are Mr. America. Don't open your eyes yet. I haven't counted three. Sleep. When I count to three, you'll open your eyes, you'll stand up, you're Mr. America, and you're gonna go back to your seat in the audience and show everybody your beautiful muscles from the waist up. <laughs> On the count of three, one, two, three. Why this feeling? Why this glow? Why this thrill? When you say hello, it's a strange. Tender magic you do Oh, Mr. Wonderful That's you Got it on Back to your seat in the audience <laughs> Show them those muscles Hold those arms up even though they're made of rubber Rubber arms, rubber arms He's not gonna buy that. Sit down in his chair and go to sleep. Sit down, Ron. Nice big hand for Ron, Mr. America. Sleep. Uh, okay, where's Billy going? Billy, oh, right down front. Oh. Billy, take a deep breath. Oh, good, Billy, take another one. I need it. <laughs> Billy, take a deep breath. When I count see Billy back to seat in the audience, you're a great actor. You are James Bond. Everybody in the audience is a secret agent and they're after your gold finger. Don't trust them. Don't touch them either. On the count of three, one, two, three. Gold finger. He's a man, a man with a modest touch. A spider's touch. He's got such a cool finger. Beckons you to enter his web of sin But don't go in Sleep oh. Look who I saved for me When I count to three, Tim, you're a great actor You're in the movies playing with me Acting with me you're Romeo and I'm Juliet. And in this scene you want me madly and passionately. However, you cannot get me. There's this large missile shield all around my body. I repeat, you cannot get me. There's this large invisible shield all around my body. This is a recording. <laughs> no, but you'll try because you're a great actor in the spotlights of cameras and you're Romeo and I'm Juliet. And uh, just get sexy and go for it, honey. On the count of three, one, two, three. <laughs> Doobie 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 He's on down, he's on down the road He's on down, he's on down the road Don't you care in the name of the Lord Come on, he's on down, he's on down the road He's on down, he's on down the road He's on down, he's on down the road 
He's so cute. Let him, I'm gonna let him get me. It's all right. When I count to three, Tim, you, you are Romeo and I'm Juliet. There's no shield. I'm all yours. <laughs> Be very, very gentle, Tim. It's my first time. <laughs> also have very, very bad breath. But you can have me. Sit right there and go for it. One, two, three. Who can I turn to when nobody needs me? My heart wants to know, and so I must go where destiny needs you. With you I could learn to Oh, with you on a new day But who can I turn to If you turn away Sleep! Grandma got some, Grandma got some All right, now we're going to get real dramatic at point. Take it <laughs> My poster boy. Take a deep breath, Tim, when I count to three. This is a big finale. On the count of three, it's a very sad, dramatic scene. You have to leave me. You do not want to leave me, but you have to. Our affair is over. We're breaking up. <laughs> and it's sad. And you're going to cry. Real tears. On the count of three, one, two, three. Softly. I'll leave you softly Or my heart will break If you should wake Tim And see me go Goodbye Tim Don't leave me softly Goodbye my love Long before you miss me I love you Long before your arms can make me stay goodbye for one more hour. I love you for one more day. Goodbye, Tim. After all these years, I can't bear the tears go to fall. So softly, bye Tim, as you leave me here. I'll always love you, Tim. I'll miss you. Go back to your seat, Tim. It's over. It's all over, Tim. Back, Tim. Back. Believe me, my lips are sealed, all of them. Sit. Sit. Goodbye, Tim. Sleep, Tim. Sleep as you live. All Chuck Hoover at the piano. Stand up, Chuck. Take a bow. Mr. Bill Blanc at the bass. Mr. Al Garibaldi at the drums. Kisses 
it up to you. Deep breath. When I count to five, wake up. Feeling great. Sleep good tonight when you want to. One, two, three, four, five. All right. Ava, when I count to five, wake up, sleep good tonight when you want to. One, two, three, four, five. Why do I? All right, Ava. I feel. Uh, a bump? Yeah. All right, Groovy. Thank you. When I count to five, wake up, feeling great, sleep good tonight when you want to. One, two, three, four, five. Why do I? I feel great. All right. Thank you very much. Pretty blue eyes. Step in your chair, bro. Right. Take a deep breath. And I count to five. Wake up feeling great. Sleep good tonight when you want to. One, two, three, four, five. By the way. Thank you. Thank you. How you feel? Uh, uh, rested? Yeah. yeah. She just got about 20 hours sleep. Thank you. Deep breath, Carmen. When I count to five, wake up, sleep good tonight when you want to. One, two, three, four, five. Go out of way. Hey, 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 guys. Thank you. Thank you. Have fun? Yes. Thank you. I appreciate it. Thank you. Take a deep breath. When I count to five, wake up, sleep good tonight when you want to. One, two, three, four, five. Now, why right do I? Next time on Hypnosis in the Media, Ms. Pat Collins. Her and Phil were after me constantly to be a stage hypnotist. I, I kept saying, no, it. I don't like stage hypnotists. They misrepresent, they act like they got power. And, the, and then they booked me on a one-nighter in Madison, Wisconsin. I didn't know it. I got out there, I thought I was going to do comedy. And it said, Pat Collins hypnotist. And I thought, all right. <laughs> and I thought, well, if I can do it my way and be honest about it, still do my comedy, look for hidden talent people, and be honest about what hypnosis is, I'll try it. So you went right into it So I there. just, I did a half hour, was tractor salesman, it was a convention, and then I thought, I'll give it a year, and if it works, I'll give it a year, if not, I'm going back to straight comedy. Thanks for watching until the end. If you want to see more, just hit the subscribe button.